Hi, my name is Gudrun from GE Designs. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to make these quick and easy bottle gift bags. You can find a printable PDF with the measurements on gequiltdesigns.com under free patterns. So start by printing that out and we can get started. You wanna start with your two pieces of fabric. You wanna have your outer fabric and your lining fabric. And you can also even play with adding embroidery to your fabric first or applique or anything you wanna do. And you wanna do that first before you get to the sewing. So the two pieces are gonna get sewn together along the short side. So you wanna lay them together. And we're just gonna stitch all the way down this side. We're going to press this seam open. And then get ready to stitch this together along the long side. But if you wanna add a ribbon to tie into the seam, what I did, I just use a, you can use a decorative ribbon and you, I cut it about 30 inches. And what you wanna do is fold it, if you have just one sided, you wanna fold it right sides together like this in half to kind of crease the sides. And this you wanna place on the outside fabric of the bag. And I placed it about five inches from the seam. So I just laid my ruler on there, placed this, and that's where I pinned this in place so it gets sewn into the seam all at the same time. You can of course just use a regular piece of ribbon and just tie it and not have it attached to the bag. Then you wanna fold this right side together. You wanna to match this seam up and pin. And pin in a couple more places along here. What we're gonna do is stitch pretty much all the way around the long sides and the ends. But we are going to leave an opening in the lining fabric. So you will notice I will sew this side and up this side, then I'm gonna leave about a three inch opening and then keep sewing all the way down here and across. Now before we turn this, we want to box the corner. So make it look more rounded on the bottom. And you want to do that both with the lining and the outer fabric. So we go to all four corners. You just kind of open this up. And what you want to do is kind of match up the seams on each side so that you can have both seams kind of falling to each side so they nest together. Then you know they are nested and this is a, a, a nice, box here and then I take my ruler any ruler and I make a box about an inch and a inch and a quarter from the tip here and I just want to draw a line right across here and then I just put a pin in here just to hold it in place and I do that with all four corners and then all we're gonna do is just stitch right across that drawn line on all four corners. Once we have that done, like here, we are just going to cut this piece off. And now we're gonna turn our bag right side out. So we go through the opening and then turn the whole thing. There, now we have our little opening here and I just wanna go ahead and stitch this. Since this is gonna be the inside of my lining, I don't even worry about making it look all pretty. I just make sure that my raw edges are folded in and I'm just gonna to top stitch it closed because nobody's ever gonna see it on that inside. And now all we have to do is push our lining inside our outer fabric of the bag. So we push this in and make sure kind of the corners 
line up and get pushed out. And then we just at the top. And then all we do is fold that little cuff over to make it look really pretty. And it's really ready for a bottle. We can pop that bottle right in there, whether it's a bottle of wine or if it's homemade liqueur or any kind of juices. Maybe you make your own um, apple cider and then tie it with a pretty ribbon. You can hang ornaments from it, monogram it, do whatever you want. And what a quick and easy way to give a nice hostess gift. I hope you enjoyed learning how easy it is to make these fast and fun bottle gift bags, whatever your bottle may contain. My name is Gudrun from GE Designs and I'll see you next time. Thank you.